What's up, everyone? Welcome back. All right, so I'm trying to figure out how the hell to get out of here. Although, I can't seem to figure it out, which is pissing me off. This is the way I came from, I think. I don't know, maybe if I try retracing my steps or something? I don't know why, I can never seem to figure out how the hell to fucking get out of these places for some fucking reason. I don't know why they always make it more difficult than it needs to be. I don't know why I can't just teleport out of here. Probably because that'd be way too fucking easy. Which wouldn't bother me one fucking bit, but whatever. Yeah, I just, I don't fucking know. So I've tried going, like, pretty much everywhere, and there's no way out. So, I don't know how the hell they expect me to get out of here when there's literally no way out of here. Yeah, I'm, I'm clearly not getting what I'm not getting here. I have tried every fucking pathway, and there seems to be no fucking way out of here. I have tried going up here, there's nothing over here. Oh, here we go. Wait, hang on. There we go. Maybe this will be a way out. Oh, this is something at least. Huh. Alright, well that just happened. Oh, and I'm back in this area. Perfect. Right back where I started. Okay, so... I mean, at least I got some free shit out of that, but... Okay. Here I thought I had finally found a way out. Nope. It's just some extra shit. Oh my god, I'm going to fucking murder whoever fucking made this stupid-ass dungeon, I swear to god. And of course I can't fucking track my way out of here because, again, that would just be too fucking easy. Like, I, I just, I don't get what I'm not getting here. There's gotta be a fucking way out of here. So again, like, what the fuck am I not getting here? Gone down this way. There's nothing over here except a dead end.
And there's no way out through here. So the only way appears to be taking this thing. So otherwise, there's literally no way to exit this fucking dungeon. Like, I, I don't get it. They want me to exit the dungeon, but there's no way to exit the fucking dungeon. That's, that's kind of a fucking problem. Kind of seems like it might be a bit of a design flaw. Can't get through here. Maybe there's something to do with that. Did not see that before. Oh, right, duh. Ah, there we go. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. I was gonna say, I did not see that shit before. Guess I should have looked around a little more. Oh. Shit. Okay, so this isn't even just a way out, it's just a way to treasure chest that has a collectible thing. So this isn't even an exit! What the f- Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking murder somebody. What the fuck? Literally wasn't even a way out, it was just an extra little bonus thing. Oh, holy fuck, I'm gonna murder somebody. I'm going to literally murder somebody. I hate this fucking dungeon! What the fuck? How the fuck do I get out of here? Some fucking directions would be nice! Like, what the fuck? This is bullshit. I would like to get out of this fucking dungeon so I can get on with the rest of the fucking game. Please and thank you. The fuck? It's fucking stupid. That's a level 3 lock, so that probably doesn't lead to anything. Okay, so this is where I came from. I might as well just retrace my steps at this point, because I got no fucking idea what else to, to fucking do. They want me to exit the dungeon, but there's no way to exit the fucking dungeon! So, again, the obvious question becomes, what the fuck? There's literally no fucking way out of here. I've searched every fucking area. What the hell? They just decide to randomly block all the areas that I came in from for some fucking reason because, hey, let's make this shit way more difficult than it fucking needs to be. Like, what the fuck?
Oh, there we go. See, I was going the wrong way. I had a feeling. Motherfucker, why do I always make that shit way more difficult than it needs to be? Fucking what the fuck. <laughs> I'll send word to Fake to meet me in the map chamber. He and the keepers need to know Ranrock has that journal and knows where the final repository is. I guess the good news, though, would be that, uh, at least with all that wandering around that I did, very angrily, might I add, at least I picked up some free clothing and shit, so that's good. Alright, can I teleport out of here now, please? Thank you, for God fucking sakes. Let's go to the Hogwarts map. Want to go to the uh, Room of Requirement. Because I do need some more uh, fucking Chinese chomping cabbages. Because I burned through quite a few there. All right, I need to go to the map chamber. Have a word with the uh, keepers or whatever. So let's do that shit. What is she doing? Yeah, I'm like really bad at exiting dungeons for some reason. Like, I don't know why, I just like can never figure out where I'm supposed to go. I don't know if it's just because I'm mentally challenged or something, but... Yeah, I don't know. Really fucking bad with directions. It's almost like I'm a female. And to be fair, I am playing as a female, so, you know, but still, I am always hilariously bad at, like, in games that are not incredibly linear, like, that's why, I actually, I know a lot of people like more open-ended games because there's more freedom to do what you want, but actually, I personally prefer more linear games, so that way I know, like, what am I supposed to be doing, because I feel like with open-ended games, I just feel like I never know like what I'm supposed to be doing or where I'm supposed to be going. That's why I like more linear games. Like tell me to go somewhere and do something and I'll do it. I like that kind of like linear game style personally. And I know a lot of people don't, but I personally do. But there's nothing wrong with playing more open-ended games for sure, but for me personally it's just hard to figure out sometimes like where I'm supposed to be going or what I'm supposed to be doing. I like to have a little more direction, I suppose. Not sure why I did that, but all right.
Alright, finally made it to the map chamber. Of course, I could have just teleported here, but that would have made too much sense. I hope Professor Fig got my owl. I need to tell him and the keepers that Renrock knows where the last repository is. According to the owl I received, Ranrock is moving more quickly than we could have anticipated. This is great news indeed. We had hoped for more time to discuss the best path forward. Let us hear what the student has to say. What up, Fig? Professor, you received my owl. Ranrock has the last of Bradball's journals. He killed Loggog to get it. He knows where the last repository is. Godric's heart. Lodgok, Lodgok and Ranrock were brothers. Lodgok was bringing the journal to me. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. Surely this changes things. Ranrock has Bragbor's journals and knows where the final repository is. We obliviated Bragbor. He kept journals? Why would he have documented all of this? He didn't know what we were containing. I'm afraid I can't say. I didn't read the journals. I fear you are correct. The situation is far from ideal, but we can wait no longer. I will defer to Professor Rockham as to how to proceed. Based upon the memories they have seen, I believe our young friend is well aware of the grave circumstances in which we find ourselves. The next trial will involve an exceptional level of magical skill and a nuanced ability to interact with beasts. Oh, shit. Find a face of stone and tendrils. I should advise you that you must engage with any beast that is part of the trial on your own. Professor Bakar will meet you in his pensive room. An exceptional level of magical skill? Nuanced ability to interact with beasts? Hmm. I suppose we should begin our search for a face of stone and tendrils, whatever that may be. Very well. Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me. Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason to raise concerns with Professor Black. I shall see you near the coast. Oh, wow, that's way far away. Shit. All right, looks like we got some traveling to do. That being said, first, though... Oh, shit! Yeah, actually, I should probably head back to the Room of Requirement. I forgot to identify those pieces of clothing that I got. Because I'm an idiot. If that has not been made abundantly obvious already. Yeah, the cabbages aren't going to be done growing just yet. Damn. Damn. I was hoping I could collect some more while I was here, but apparently not. Has some exciting news to share. Oh boy, I am not looking forward to this uh, next trial, though, if it's going to involve beasts. Because I am not good at catching beasts or dealing with them, if I'm being honest. I do like them, don't get me wrong. Some of them are really cool, but actually catching them is a bit of a pain in the fucking cock. Um, right, I was going to check out the gear. So apparently I got some gear that's even better. Yeah, those aren't bad. I'm still not a huge fan of either of those styles, though, so fuck it. Yeah, it doesn't really match any of my shit super well, but... Eh, whatever. Functionality is more important, I guess. Mm. 
No, I can't use that shit yet. Well, that's dumb. Eh, whatever. Might as well go sell off the rest of that clothing. for delivering those potions to Madame Lawen. Save me a lot of time and trouble. It's getting me a lot of money, which is good. See you again. Farewell for now. All right. I need to figure out where the hell I'm supposed to be going for this next fucking trial. Apparently, way the hell over there, which. I've definitely never been over there before. Um, yeah, again, this map is much bigger than I ever would have thought, that's for sure. So we'll travel there, I guess. Whoops, not what I meant to do. Alright. Well, either way, folks, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. So, we're going to get heading towards that point uh, next time. So, yeah, stay tuned for that shit coming up next. Until then, peace out.